Some millennials are probably wondering why their dining table is those strong metal base legs bearing the word singer. Well, well, those are actually the repurposed legs of a Singer treadle sewing machine dating as far back as the mid 1800s. Kilalang kilala itong uh, Singer sewing machine na ito. Kasi matibay ito. Pag nakita mo yung base nito, oh, gawa ito sa metal at saka napakaganda ng pagka-engineer niya, napakakita mo, tibay. Nung elementary kami, tinuruan kaming manahi. Hindi lang ako marunong magtabas, marunong lang ako magpaandar ng makina. Kasi nung elementary kami, kasama yan sa aming curriculum. Wala naman tayo mga ready to wear nung araw. Karamihan talaga magpapa-etso-diretso ka. Ibig sabihin, mag magpapatahi ka ng damit mo. So maraming mga mananahi nung araw. Now, when the production of clothes became commercialized, the Singer treadle sewing machine, which was powered by a foot pedal, also slowly went out of fashion. Yung nga lang, nakakalungkot dahil nga sa pagpasok ng mga ready to wear at mga murang mga damit mula sa iba't ibang bansa, limbawa sa China, kumukonti na ang mga mananahi. Dahil kinakailangan mong mabilis at mas maraming gumagamit, mas automatic na yung ginagamit nila o yung electric sewing machine. But trust the Pinoy to come up with new ways to give its sturdy metal-based legs a new lease on life. Ang nanay ko ay isang mananahe, so mayroon kaming ganyan. Pero ngayon, table na lang siya. Siguro, dahil nakakapanghinayang naman, matiba yung bakal, ginawa na lang nilang lamesa. Yung paa niya, yung makina, nilagyan na lang ng kahoy para i-convert na lamesa. The Americans, when they manufacture stuff up to now, they build it to last. Just for that alone, dahil alam mo matibay, you would want to buy it kahit na luma kasi subok na eh. Pangalawa, alam mong antik yan. So it has added value being more than 100 years old. Pangatlo, maganda yung design. So it's uh, useful, it's decorative, and uh, it has value as a uh, collectible. So all three.